Unit 8. Tape script 8.1. Rooms of a house. Bathroom. Bedroom. Kitchen. Dining room. Living room. Tape script 8.2. Things in a house. A bed. A cooker. A sofa. A TV. A shower. A toilet. A table. A fridge. An armchair. A lamp. A picture. A magazine. A DVD player. A laptop. A desk. Tape script 8.3. Robert's living room. My living room isn't very big, but I think it's great. There's an old sofa and there are two armchairs. There's a table with a TV and a DVD player on it. There's also a PlayStation. I love all the games. There are some books and there are a lot of pictures and posters on the walls. There are two lamps. My room's not very tidy, but it's really comfortable. Tape script 8.4. Questions and answers. Is there a sofa? Yes, there is. Is there a desk? No, there isn't. Are there any armchairs? Yes, there are. Are there any photographs? No, there aren't. Tape script 8.5. Robert and his mum. Hi, mum. Robert, how are you? How's the new flat? It's great, mum. I love it. It's really comfortable. Oh, and tidy? Uh, well. So, tell me about it. Is there a nice sofa? Well, there's an old sofa, but it's OK. Mm. And are there any chairs? Yes, of course there are chairs. There are two big armchairs. Oh, good. And a TV? Is there a TV? Oh, yes, there is. The TV's really big. And I have a DVD player and a PlayStation and... A PlayStation? Why? Mum, I love playing games. OK, OK. So, is there a desk? There isn't a desk in the living room, but there's one in the bedroom. Good. Now, are there any pictures on the walls? Any photographs of your family? Well, in the living room, there are my posters of New York and Sydney, but there aren't any photographs. They're all in my bedroom. OK. Now, your father and I want to see this flat. Can we visit next... Visit? You want to visit? Yes. We're free next weekend. Can we come? Uh, next weekend. Uh, sorry, Mum. Uh, I think I'm... Um... Tape script 8.6. Robert's bedroom. 1. His laptop is on the desk. 2. The CD player is next to the laptop. 3. There are three books on the floor next to his bed. 4. His car keys are in the drawer. 5. There's a football on the floor under the desk. 6. His trainers are next to his bag under his bed. Tape script 8.7. Questions and answers. 1. Do you live in a house or a flat? 2. How many bedrooms are there? 3. Is there a phone in the kitchen? 4. Is there a television in the living room?
Five. Is there a DVD player under the television? Six. Are there a lot of books in your bedroom? Seven. Are there any pictures on the wall? Tape script eight point eight. Which room is it? There's a cat on the sofa, and there's a phone on a small table next to the sofa. There's a CD player with some CDs under it. Not a lot of CDs. There isn't a TV, and there aren't any pictures or photographs on the walls. There's one lamp. It's next to the table with the phone. There are two tables and two armchairs. There are some books under one of the tables. Tape script eight point nine. Vancouver, the best city in the world. Vancouver is called the best city in the world. Why? Is it the spectacular mountains? The beautiful beaches, the excellent shops and restaurants—it's all of this and more. Where is it? Vancouver is in southwest Canada, next to the Pacific Ocean, twenty-four miles from the U.S. border. When to go? It is always a good time to visit Vancouver. The weather is never too cold or too hot. It is warm and sunny in summer, but it rains a lot in autumn and winter. What to do? In spring, go skiing in the mountains in the morning, and sunbathe on the beach in the afternoon. In summer, go swimming, sailing, or fishing, or go walking in North America's biggest park, Stanley Park. There are excellent shops in Yale Town. And there is also theater, opera, and music of every sort. Vancouver is the city of festivals. Where to eat? Vancouver is a cosmopolitan city, so there are French, Italian, Japanese, Indian, Thai, and Chinese restaurants. Vancouver's Chinatown is the second biggest in North America, after San Francisco. There is also a lot of delicious fresh seafood. Where to stay? In the busy city center, there are some excellent, expensive hotels. The beautiful Fairmont Hotel is four hundred dollars a night, but next to the sea, there are a lot of cheap, comfortable hotels from fifty-nine dollars a night. How to travel? You don't need a car in Vancouver. There are slow old trolley buses, and there is the fast modern Sky Train. Take the ferry. It is a great way to see the city. Tape script eight point ten. My hometown. Hi, my name's Steve, and I live in Vancouver. I work at an international bank. In the center of the city, but I live in English Bay near the beach. I have a small apartment there. Vancouver's a great city; it's really cosmopolitan. People from all over the world live here. Every Friday after work, my girlfriend and I go to Chinatown and have delicious Chinese food. It's my favorite. I like the weather. Because it's never too hot or too cold, but it rains a lot, and I don't like that. I work hard and I play hard. I love sport, and Vancouver's good for so many sports. In winter, I go skiing every weekend. I like snowboarding too. In summer, I go swimming and I play golf. I often go cycling with my girlfriend. Sometimes we cycle along the Vancouver seawall to the park, Stanley Park. The mountains look fantastic from there. Why doesn't everyone want to live in Vancouver? It's the best place to live in the world. 
Tape script 8.11. Who is it? Conversation 1. Morning. Monday again. Yeah, I hate Mondays, and it's another busy day. I know. I have three meetings this morning. Conversation 2. Hi. Can I meet you after work? Yeah, that's great. Six o'clock okay? We can go to that restaurant next to the Chinese supermarket. Fine. I want to go there again. The food's delicious. Conversation 3. Oh, no. Rain again. Well, it's not so bad. Yes, it is. The sky's really black. You're right. No golf today, then. Conversation 4. It's a lovely afternoon. You want to go out? Yeah. Where do you want to go? What about Stanley Park? Great. I love that park. The mountains look fantastic from there. Come on, then. Let's get the bikes. Tape script 8.12 Directions 1. Go up North Road... Turn left at the bank into Charles Street. It's on the right, next to the theatre. 2. Go up North Road, turn right at the school into Hillside Road, and it's on the left, next to the chemists. 3. Go up North Road, turn right at the church into Station Road, Go straight down, and it's on the right, next to the car park. 4. Go straight on up North Road for five minutes, and it's in Albert Square. It's a big building on the right. 5. Go straight on up North Road. At the post office, turn left into Park Lane. It's on the right, past the Chinese restaurant.